Delighted to say we're joined by Greg Abbott. Greg, uh, thanks very much for joining us. What's the nerves like? Mine, all right. You know, I think um, we have prepared as well as we can. You know, and when you've done that, you have to go into uh, into the game and um, give it your best shot. You know, I think it's what happens now when the players walk over the white line. I don't think Stuart and the staff could have done anything anything else, anything different, anything better than the way they've been prepared for the match. So uh, let's hope we get it right on the pitch and uh, you know everything goes our way. What's this last week been like? The club? Um, well, it's from the, the you know the, the day we beat Fleetwood. It's been sort of a, a, a waiting period. You know, what do you do? Do you train? Do you not train? Do you train hard? Do you train little? But I think we've had a balance. Stuart's had a little bit of time off. A lot of tech, you know, tech, technical and tact, uh, tactical work along the way. Team preparation. We've delivered all the Millwall stuff, strengths, weaknesses, all that sort of thing. So no, I think it's been good, and um, I just think the boys now are in itching. I, I was with them yesterday before they set off. They went down yesterday, and. Um, they were buzzing uh, and, and, a, and, a, and a confidence about them without without thinking this is going to be you know any because it'll be a tough game by the way this is uh, two good sides going head to head um, again it, what happens out there against down the, two, the the lads that go out and step over that white line hopefully it's us but it's been a fantastic season up to now hasn't it Jake? brilliant when you think of where you know we were with Stuart walked in the door and it's a symbol of staff it's a symbol of playing squad and to be fair credit to the whole of the club from top to bottom. Everybody's played the part, and you don't get here with this type of sit or, or level of success to, to an extent. It's not finished. The job's obviously not finished yet, but without everybody playing their part, everybody doing the job properly, and, and, and the to get together as a unity. I think Stuart's brought a lot of that to the club. The togetherness, the unity. Everybody's important. You know, I spoke to him this morning, and uh, you know, he's telling me how well I've done, and I'm just forget about us. You just concentrate, looking after them boys, Stuart. Get them over the line, and uh, there'll be never be a prouder man. There's going to be some support here as well, backing you. Yeah, I mean, looking around us now, you know, we've been up that top on the, the hotel, looking over, and obviously Millwall haven't got so far to go, so they'll probably come a bit later, but the place is swarming with Bradford okay. fans. Yeah, and, uh, yeah they're, all, they're all behind us, so listen, they're here, they're going to sing, they're going to support. They're great people, they support the, the, the team through thick and thin, always have done, and let's hope we get them across the line. Do you think, no? what type of score will be? I think you'll take a scrappy 1-0 one, no, one. horrible game. Well, I got, it, I got it right for Fleetwood, 1-0 over the two legs. The bookmakers won't want me to predict it right again, but I think the goals. So 2-1-3-2. Two, two. And you know which way I mean. We'll take that. I'll take that.